So much love and appreciation to those of you who have been with me for the two year period plus that I've been doing this. Um, thank you for showing your uh, love and support to the channel and to anybody else who is brand new to the platform and you would like to support the channel. Also, you can do it by way of Patreon, Anchor, the clothing store, and also the shoe shop that is listed in the comment description below. And again, thank you to any and all of you guys who have been here to support this channel during the two plus year period i wouldn't be able to do what i do every single day without you this battle is about to explode live and let die all right so <laughs> this is not one of my normal videos uh i actually just to be honest i had a whole nother video uh set up on glorilla but i'm like you know what i can't even do it because I actually have to do something a little bit different because magically it seems like even black women are uh, immensely judging her. And it's not due to the lyrical content of her music, but it's due to the way that she looks and how it is that she sounds vocally and how you now have black women trying to, in a sense, if you will, kill two birds with one stone, right? Go after another black woman who is in a sense famous getting money and she's getting attention from men and then you also have those very same black women deciding that hey well since we're taking her down let's also take down black men as well by try to you know refer to them as gay if they like her her music um or the way that she sounds on top of other things just in case you don't believe what i'm saying let me just go to the comments One person stated it's because the deep voice makes them think about men because they love when other men talk about beating it up another one next person stated it's not genuine in some ways i feel like they barely see her as a woman which is a different issue in itself another one men's love for glorilla just don't seem genuine to me finally got a rapper that don't rap about her stuff yes she does and you do like that song too men like coochie rap but only when it comes from a deep voice another one to be honest i would rather see people with monkey pox on my timeline than glorilla with no makeup here comes a new challenger the way other black women discuss desirability re other black women is very weird I can't explain it the way I want, but the discourse behind Glorilla and if men do or do not like her to wondering if The Rock likes black women behind his answer regarding Meg is all weird. For example, men are gay for liking Glorilla's voice. Other women were talking about her masculinity in such an anti-black way. Are y'all ops or nah? You don't hear yourselves talking, I'm convinced. The Rock was asked a question and it was not that deep wasn't deep enough for party to fill away and it wasn't deep enough to be divisive and wonder if he likes black women y'all don't ever rest saying glorilla is masculine and that men only like her because they are gay is a hating tweet at 8 a.m that's what you woke up thinking about shaking my head brother stated first black men ain't supporting y'all enough now we supporting too much lol bruh which one is it men gay for listening to glorilla is crazy y'all be acting like men the bullies it really be y'all miserable women y'all the ones told her to get a bbl y'all the ones comparing men liking her to liking they homeboys women are the bullies empowerment my butt so the new way to call straight black men gay is to say that we only like glorilla because she has a deep voice y'all really have no bounds. i found a way to hate on glorilla by saying men's love for her ain't genuine y'all something else i feel like this next comment has to be one of the greatest highlights and it touches on something that i've talked about on this channel a multitude of times women be about women's empowerment until that woman is doing better than them especially when it comes to getting attention from men these women are miserable af that's what we like to call big damage now let me just put it like this into a better perspective right since the women out here on social media 
and elsewhere don't have a large enough target aka kevin samuels in order to direct all of their animosity and anger at they pretty much went right back to normal which means that they're going right back to um talking negatively about each other being envious uh being jealous um tearing each other down and yet these are the exact same ones that state that they are about a sisterhood they are about supporting um other black women and you know they're not for all of the body shaming and everybody looking the exact same way you had a woman that literally stated that other women were telling her that she needs to get her body done pay attention to that glorilla aka which is short for gloria she is natural she has her same body type her same frame that she has always had she has never done anything to change or rearrange her body in order to appeal or be more attractive right to men and to also quote unquote be accepted by other women out there so now you have these women who have done all of these body modifications and they can't really seem or attain the attention that they want from men but yet you have somebody with the body frame and type of glorilla who can come along and because she doesn't fit in that ideal spectrum now you have women trying to internalize that and be like you know what i know why the guys don't want me and why they like her that's because they're gay that's because they're gay everything about her reminds uh, uh them of their homeboys that they like to uh spend time with and, and be around with instead of trying to be with me that's how women are internalizing this whole thing and this is how they're throwing uh hate directly at another black woman now i want to note this right the the one record which I, I was going to do a video and cover directly on this platform but i have to do it in a different way in a sense dealing with this video um she was from what i was able to understand she was independent right which means that nobody owned any of her stuff right that was basically just you know her and and, and just her pushing her stuff directly out there and people naturally catching on to um you know how it is that she sounds you know raps lyrics all of that stuff and her song went number one on the urban charts that's big that's big you got some people that have been rapping since 2006 still ain't get noticed and they still consistently putting out music still ain't get noticed she just popped up on the scene independent and people know who she is people know her songs she's doing shows right like i said before which one is it and, and, and this is a question specifically to black women do you want black men to support black female artists or do you not want black men to support black female artists or is it that you want us to specifically support the ones that you want us to to specifically support like it, it it doesn't make any type of sense because the moment in time that we do is like oh y'all only support her because she's showing off her body it's because of her lyrics it's the way that she looks it's because you guys are colorist it's because she don't really look like a black woman it's because her hair ain't natural y'all will list all of these things right but then when it is that we just so happen to not support right black female artists like oh you guys are misogynistic uh you guys are just afraid of women out doing y'all making bigger numbers having better bars having better beats y'all just jealous y'all just envious y'all just afraid of women stepping up and being independent and not being in a man's shadow y'all just want to have like which one is it which one is it like that like, like i said before this is why when it comes to guys we just let stuff be what it is we just mind our own business because no matter if we do or don't we just lose it's an l either type of way that's that's how it is like i said that's how it is for guys no matter what you do as a man you're always going to lose that's just the way that the universe works if you're a woman you're just going to take all the w's in the world it doesn't matter if you're wrong 100 of the time you're still going to be right and you're still going to be catching wins 
as a guy you're always going to catch l's no matter what you do even if like some of the guys here got the best intentions like yo i just like the way that she raps i like some of the bars yada 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 it it, it still comes off as like yo you're going to be receiving that l because you just like her because she sound like your brother she sound like your homeboy she sound like a, a guy that you want to be with on the download like it's crazy and i also want to touch on this too out of every other culture of women out here it's only black women that want to consistently state that black men are gay. I've never, ever in life heard a grouping of other women from other ethnicities consistently doing this to their men. I've never, I've never seen this. I've never heard of this. Like I said before, this is the strangest thing to me. And it's like things are like finally clicking for me. Right. Because short little story time right when i was younger right and i was probably about like maybe like six or or seven right me and my friends sitting up there talking about like cartoons power rangers and stuff like that just you know just like walking down the street like skipping rocks you know like across the concrete and whatnot and i overhear right two older black women having a conversation and one of the black women decides to because i saw it out the the corner of my eye she decides to point at me while she's sitting in that white lawn chair and she basically stays to the other black woman was like oh you know he he looks he looks gay i'm like for me now let me put you in a perspective during that timeline um for me i didn't even know what the terminology even meant even though i have uh people in my family who are gay during that time frame i didn't even know what that terminology even realistically meant i was a little bit confused i'm like what 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 does that <laughs> what does that even mean and it's like on top of that like why would you like even you know say something about somebody else that you don't even know on top of the fact that you are a grown woman judging a child and it's like now it's like everything is just like fully clicking here i'm like yo black women are the only ones doing this and it's like it doesn't make sense like it, it just does somebody really has to make that make sense for me i would i would really love it just just the honest opinion i would really love it if black women could really give a logical reason as to why it is that you guys are the only ethnicity of women that no matter what takes place the first thing that y'all want to go to is trying to call a black man or a young black boy gay without any type of proof without any type of proof you don't have no determining factors you don't have a voice to go off of. you don't have nothing but this is something that y'all like doing and it's like it, it it's 100 percent crazy like like i said before hey <laughs> it is what it is at the end of the day like i said I, I i for me i try to make sense of a lot of things and to see the same thing that i've heard in the past when i was younger and i'm looking at black women saying this online to adult black men who are just simply supporting a black female artist because they might like her lyrics or her beats or whatever it is that is baffling to me like i said it's baffling to me i would love an honest answer i would i would love especially from the the, the black women who sit in the cut who sit way back in the shadows and they just want to speak at certain times come out the shadows come directly into the light and right in the comment section why is it and i'm generalizing because rightfully so i have the right to do that why is it that y'all like doing this like i said somebody make it make sense to me <laughs> and then you know we, we, we'll have that you know discussion in the in the comment section depending on you know if people want to be honest or not you know about this actually being a thing i'm pretty sure i might receive some deflections because people just don't want to be honest people just don't want to be honest right but hey it is what it is <laughs>